Okay. Hi, it's Wendy Mather here from Not Apiary Products, and we are here close to Half Moon Bay. Where exactly are we in California right now? San Mateo. San Mateo. And I'm here this afternoon with Roy Crumrine and Dr. Heather Gamper. And please tell us what we're doing in this lovely apiary in San Mateo, California this afternoon. Sure, well we're interested in looking at the effect of formic acid treatment on mite levels and viral loads in bees and uh, we're also doing some interesting monitoring during the course of the year's experiment. Yeah, I was noticing when I was helping you work the bees, there are sensor boxes built into the back and attached to uh, the back of every hive. Roy, can you tell us a bit about that? Yes, the temperature is going to be used to look at what the effects of the temperature and humidity on the hives when the formic acids are added to the hive. Wow, that's great. And am um, I understanding that you designed these sensors yourself? You built them yourself? Yes, we have about 30 of them total in all the hives that we're using for the study. Yeah, and the study that you and uh, Dr. Gamper have uh, co-written, you, you designed and developed the protocol yourselves. Um, how many hives in total are involved? 27 hives total, but 30 sensors because of the three outside temperature and humidities for comparison. And I'd like to thank you on behalf of Not Apiary Products. We're really, really excited to discover and learn about the results of this research, which I understand is going to span over the course of a year, which yes. is great. We'll get two treatments in. And um, Not Apiary Products is, is really proud to provide you with some Max Plus in which you can conduct the research yes, with. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. And I'll look forward to uh, nice. look forward to getting in touch with you again at, 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 as the results unfold. Great, we'll keep you posted. Thank you.